Van Gaal is correct. He's genuinely correct about like a, about Man and I being a, a commercial club rather than a football club as well. Because the thing is too, right? For me too, what I, I'm worried about is the way that they're pro prolonging like this next manager phase. You know, like they, they're trying to pick up the right candidates for the right man. fam. They, they try the, the board, right? The, the Man United board, they're trying to pick the right manager who they can control. That's it. That's literally it, guys. Like, it, 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 it pains me that I'm saying this about United, fam. About United, because we, we should be a footballing club, right? First, through, like, through and through. Football first. Not how many uh, t shirts are we gonna sell, you know, like, like Ronaldo number seven in the new fourth kit, which is black and gold, you know, like, guys go buy it and stuff like that. Also, right, there was a, a time too, if you look at the um, t t Twitter bios, right, on every football team, like, um, I, I, I think we were like with Chelsea, like, 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 they had a buyer for like a charity. Then my and I had a buyer for the United store. I'm like, yo, are you, are you effing kidding me, fam? Are you effing kidding me, bro? Like, as long as if they glazers orange, bro. Uh, again, I, I, when I read this quote, right, in my mind, I was like, as long as if the parasite glazers are in charge of Man United, we're going to be commercial FC, fam. We're going to be commercial FC no matter what. Look at the players that we have. <laughs> Look at the players that we have, bro. Like, they're prime candidates, right, for social media FC, bro. They're prime candidates, bro. Like, look at Rashford. Man, people, like, of course, this joke's gone on for like a year now, right? People are, like, are starting to mock him, bro. Even even when he comes out with, like, a Instagram post, boy, and people, are, like, are saying, like, oh, are you not going to write, like, a paragraph or, like, a statement? Because, again, like, it's, it's, it's what he does now whenever he, he has, like, one bad game, fam, or even anything goes on, like, or, like <laughs> in the news, bro, he always writes, like, long, long statements. Luke Shaw coming out as well, saying, oh, you know... I feel like I'm not wanted at United, you know, whenever I leave United and come to England, I'm always happy and stuff like that. And I'm, and I'm just like, you, you're giving contracts to these guys. You give, you, they're out here, they're out here giving contracts to, to, to these sort of players. You get me? Like, I, I don't get, I genuinely, bro, like, it's so frustrating. It's really frustrating too, you know, and again, I, I, I Paul Pogba too, you know. I'm, I, I hate saying this about, about about all these kind of things, but when 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 Paul Pogba again gets like a new haircut, man moves like he's a GTA character from 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 San Andreas. You know when you start like you know when you sat down like in a bar in San Andreas and you you get like the haircut, like <laughs> he's got the bald head, and then whatever like the barber shaves it, he instantly grows like an afro. That's what it is. That's what it is, bro. And it's always, they're always out here posting as well for all for, for, all for social media and stuff like that, bro. Like, we just want to see results on the pitch. We generally want to see results on the pitch too. And it always scares me. This, this, and every single time when a new manager joins, bro, it always scares me because the board will lie through their teeth. They'll lie through their teeth as well to get the guy that they want to, again, control, right? They'll say, oh, we, listen, Eric, right? You are the perfect candidate for my United. You, right, will, 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 will let you sign five players, right, um, in this summer transfer for you to actually pick it, for actually you uh, to, to pick the team that you want. Pick, pick the players I want to, to stand as well, right? And then Ten Hag goes, okay, I want Graven Birch and Anthony to come with me because I've actually worked for him at Ajax, you know, and a right winger and, and midfielder as well. And, and then we can go for a, a centre-back like Jules Kunde or a Paul Torres, yeah, like, like to actually come in and, and, and help out Varane. Then these morons, our board, they'll, they'll turn around and be like, uh, Anthony, you know, he's, he's not, he's not like that kind of guy that, uh, would sell t-shirts as well, you know, because like he, he, he's not popular, like, uh, outside of the pitch. This is how they think, like, this is how they think, like, for, for me, I'm not surprised. Like, the, the thing is too, right? Apparently they want to sign Harry Kane. Like, what the, f don't get me wrong, Harry Kane's one of the best strikers in the world, but again, he's old, bro. He's, I'm pretty sure he's 30 this year. Man's old. Around this time, he always gets injured. This, this is the prime time Harry Kane gets injured around like March, April, May time, fam. You know what I mean? And they want that they, they want to come out here and buy Harry Kane, but we we should be going out there and, and getting a a, a a more uh hungrier younger player fam. That's not a cost us more like money like hundred million for Harry Kane, bro. And 
the, yeah, bro. It, it, it again. It pays me. It pays me to say this. It pays me to say this. But Van Gaal's correct, bro. That that warning he gave to Ten Hag is absolutely. It's warranted, fam. It's the absolute truth. It's the absolute truth because again, who, who the the people that run us right now will never bring us back to the top. They will never bring us back to the top as well because what they again what they care about revenue dividends selling shirts social media fc one million followers as well you know <laughs> it's mental it's absolutely crazy it's absolutely crazy but it's it's true you know we're a commercial club we're a commercial club and it's painful we, we genuinely are a commercial club because of the glazers and the idiots that run us you know what I mean? And some of the players that actually go along with these things as well, you know. But guys, that's been the video. If you've got any thoughts, comments, or concerns, comment down below. As the usual, you know, like give free speech down in the comments, just be nice to each other. If you like it, support your boy, don't forget to subscribe. Guys, I've been Preston speaking about how the Louis Van Gaal speaking facts about United. He's speaking facts, and I'm excited, guys. Keep it real. Peace.